Well, on Monday, we showed you the train carrying hundreds of men, women, and children pulling into Juarez. Some of them surrendered to Border Patrol. CBP has just confirmed that cartels are once again spreading lies to those who want to seek asylum here in the U.S. Today, KTSM find out where some of them are spending the day on this side of the border. Our camera captured several groups settled at San Pacinta Plaza in downtown El Paso. Many on, were on their phones. A family with children were eating at the park. Most are carrying bags and backpacks with their belongings and blankets from the American Red Cross. And CBP is aware of reports that criminal organizations, this is a statement sent to us uh, this afternoon, late this afternoon, CBP is aware of reports that criminal organizations in the El Paso, Texas, Juarez, Mexico areas are spreading falsehoods and putting migrants' lives at risk for their own financial gain. These rumors are absolutely false and yet another dangerous example of bad actors sharing bad information. The border is not open to illegal migration, end quote. And according to the city's migrant dashboard, more than 4,500 migrants are in CBP custody. That is up from over 4,100 yesterday. CBP also saw over 1,300 encounters today. That's 100 more than yesterday. And right now, over 19,000 migrants are being served at the Welcome Center.